A Nashville business owner is heartbroken after the recent shooting death of one of its employees in New Orleans. Her murder sparking concerns for his tour guides in other big cities. Jaxie Pigeon sharing his sentiment this morning. The life of the party and the mother hen all in one. That's how Brian Kane describes his employee, Christy Thibodeau. The 43-year-old was shot to death while sitting in her car in the New Orleans French Quarter neighborhood, the same place she spent most of her days as a tour guide for Crawl Entertainment Group. The suspects in the case, a 19-year-old in the country illegally, a 17-year-old, and a 15-year-old with an arrest record and an ankle monitor that was not working. All three are in custody, facing charges of second-degree murder and attempted armed robbery. Thibodeau's death comes as cities across the country are struggling with underage offenders with easy access to guns, carrying out violence and robberies. Kane has locations across the globe, including here in Nashville. He tells me it's tough to wrap his mind around what happened to Thibodeau and fears more tragedies like this can happen if changes aren't made. I've always kind of worried about this, never realizing it was going to hit so close to home. It's Unfortunately, the, the system needs to uh, change because, uh, you know, this person wasn't supposed to be on the street. They were wearing an ankle monitor that wasn't even being tracked. So that makes it even that much more difficult to deal with knowing that, you know, these people shouldn't have been out doing it. So I would say there needs to be some sort of reform for juvenile crime and a responsibility that doesn't allow them to commit violent crimes and then go back out onto the street just with absolutely no recourse. A new law in Louisiana aims to hold electronic monitoring companies accountable if they fail to keep track of an offender. That law takes effect in January. And following Thibodeau's murder, the Louisiana Attorney General says her office will be investigating ankle monitoring companies.